What's up guys, Tyler here with Tarver Academy. I'm so excited you're with us today. Today we're gonna learn a little bit of this guy. I'll give you a hint, we're working on Pythagorean Theorem. You're gonna work this problem and then we're gonna work it together to see if you got it correct, okay? So I'd love you to work this and while you're waiting, you can hit that red subscribe button. <laughs> you can get math help whenever you want, no big deal. Plus we have more fun videos, Tarver Academy. Here we go, okay, so we wanna find X. You've got your hypotenuse, which is 10, and we know that's the hypotenuse because it is opposite the right angle. It's also gonna be our longest angle, or our longest side in this. It's opposite the largest angle, is the longest side, sorry. This one is nine, this one's x. So with a right triangle, like I said before, we're using Pythagorean theorem, okay? Now, with Pythagorean theorem, the one that matters is c. That has to be your hypotenuse. The other two, you can get them flip-flopped. C has to be your hypotenuse. We know this is our hypotenuse, so I'm gonna make that 10 squared. Other two, doesn't matter. So I'll make this my A, make this my B. So now it's X squared plus nine squared equals 10 squared. Now we're just solving for X. So we've got X squared here, nine squared is 81, we got 10 squared is 100. All right, now I need to get X by itself, so I gotta get rid of 81. So I'm gonna subtract it from both sides. That cancels out. I've got X squared equals 19. Now, you've gotta do the opposite to get rid of that square. What is the opposite of squaring something? I'll give you a hint, it's actually in the name. Square, square root. Let's go. So whenever you do square root, what are those Guardians of the Galaxy? They call it square root. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so whenever you do that, it cancels that out. So X equals radical 19. Now, some teachers might want this to be how you put your answer. They want it. This is the most exact answer you can put, okay? Now, some of them might want you to actually do like a number with a decimal. And so if you put that in your calculator, square root of 19, you're going to get probably like 4 point, oh, I don't know. I think I put it in my calculator earlier. Uh, 3, 6 and then something's happening. So it'd be like similar to that. That's not, that's not the right term. It, it's that and then it goes on for a while, okay? They might not want that. They might want you to round to the nearest hundredth. Just look at how they, the example is. So if it's multiple choice, look for either option, okay? So there you go. I hope you learned something. Thank you for joining me on this journey. You wanna subscribe? Um, you'll make 100 on every test you take this year. It's true, try it. Later. Hey, thank you for watching that video. If you would please hit that red subscribe button if that helped at all. And also, if you want, I've got tons more exclusive videos on my Patreon. Links in the bio if you want. No pressure. No pressure. Zero pressure, okay? You're, it's totally cool. But yeah, but you do need to subscribe. It's, for, it's free.